Spartan Trail. It's U.S. versus INS here on the Core Valley. U.S. have a stranded squad in the western side of the map. They are uh, stranded. It's sad times. So, U.S. are going to mobilize a force at Cop Sword, as well as a uh, uh, mechanized force out of their main. These are pretty, these are pretty light reactionary troops. They're going to be moving out to get the stranded squad, recover them, and get them to an exfil location. Once they're at an exfil location, U.S. forces will be able to do things like, I don't know, reinforce themselves, like with HMG and fortifications to hold out against a potential INS reattack on their position. INS, on the other hand, they get to start in a lot of different places, potentially, and they get to, their mission objectives are to uh, find the stranded squad and eliminate them. Secondary objective is to eliminate all U.S. forces in Core Valley. Uh, the brief, Racer probably because he's in command. All right, looks like this is everybody. So we're going to go ahead and get started with this platoon brief. All right, here we go. All right, so long and short of it is essentially uh, we've just received an urgent mission. Uh, there was a patrol that was sent out last night that has been delayed in their return. We believe they are holding out somewhere to the west. We actually know exactly where they're holding out because we have maintained comms with them. They have holed up in a mosque up in Delta 7-1 over with Squad 1. They're currently trying to lay low and hope that the insurgent patrols searching for them don't find them too quickly. But, well, we're not going to rely on that. So that's why the rest of us are here. So up northeast, we have 8th Full Squad who will be handling some VIX as well as some supplies that will be coming in. They're going to be basically just going down the northern roads and taking up high ground positions to try to cover those of you who are here with me right now. So move on to our responsibility. So Phoenix's squad will be moving west off life down the river. You should be able to still see the kind of arrow down the river. And eventually uh, taking up positions by the helmet mark. Your goal is basically to keep them from salting from the southeast because the musk is vulnerable from that location. And also move into the point if they need assistance. Next up we have... Merrick's squad, he'll be moving down south. Uh, there's some high ground down there for a good base of fire. We're also trying to, once again, uh, keep them guessing about where the squad is. That's his main job out there. However, it should put him in a good position for uh, later in the operation when we may need a flanking element. Any questions? Later. All right, cool. Squad leads, break him out. For okay, so. I love the heat. And here is, uh... I'm the only one who can drop radio. Oh! It's, t it's taken a fucking while, because we've had SLs constantly DC. Do we get the fire teams? Yeah, I'll organize that in a sec, sorry. No, Live no in over. a minute and a half. So this is the plan. Only leads. So the plan is, uh, INS, can INS see from here? Yeah. Yeah. So basically, US are gambling on INS not taking this high ground to help secure this compound, and INS just blowing right past it. Also, if someone can look at me, Sas, can you look to your right a bit and make sure that I'm not, uh, like up in a weird angle here? You are. Yeah, you're on. Yeah. I am. Yep, you are. Yeah, okay. I, no, you're sure good. You... That's better. That's All right. Better. All yeah, right. just lay it out. There you go. That's a lot better. Your legs kind of go up into the minute right there, man. Who, mine? mine? Yeah, your right leg. If it's just my toe... I think you're the... good now. I think you're good now. Okay. No, it's like just your full foot. Okay. Yep. Also, this if you guys want play. to want to take fire, feel free to dig up these sandbags. Look, the car... If I what? live through this... We start taking contact, big pump. Dollars. Ah, shit. What was that? Uh, that was, was the, the truck. That's all right. That was the yeah, IOLOGY. Oh, that was the logic truck. Yeah. Well, good luck, gentlemen. Be careful, I'm gonna go I, horribly right or horribly bad. If I you tell bad. my girlfriend that I wish she was real? All right, All right no, no fucking moving, boys. my family, I love them. In fact, I'm taking right. my pistol out right Scott now. Scottish's girlfriend that doesn't exist. He misses you. All right, we're live with round one. 
Uh, we're gonna watch INS do their thing. Four squads moving out. Bacon Batman is in charge of the squad. No, Blackbeard's in charge of the squad over here, I think, isn't he? Yeah, Blackbearded Squad 1. These guys are gonna be the ones that are moving out towards the, uh... The potential. Oh, and they're taking the high ground. Oh, this is not good. Ines gets some vehicle scrounge. As far as their kits for this operation, Ines have two ARs, one medic per squad, no FTLs. They get six RPG uh, classes, or six RPG kits that they can distribute. They got a rocket techie <laughs> and two motorcycles and anything that's not at main, they can take after live. U.S. moving out. Uh, still about a click distance here between U.S. and INS Force proper. And here comes, uh, looks like we've got the convoy moving out. Splodge driving for far side in the first MRAP. Arnis driving for Lima Bean in the second. And Aethel commanding uh, Tails driving the Lodgy with a fire team for security. And they are zooming all around because they have to. But the idea is they want to get to here because you got the elevation here. This is an important position to hold. Uh, however, with the amount of lats that INS have, it's a very open position to hold for obvious reasons. Uh, all right, my immersion. All right, so Blackbeard is chilling. Yo, if Blackbeard actually sees these guys right now, no, there's no way. Actually, is there a way? Hold on, from here? No. As long as no one stands up, they got a chance. But their holding position, Dwarf Squad to the south, we'll have no idea these guys are up here. They are moving. They're closer, but they're moving. Actually, they split up. Looks like he set a fire team to just push through the, uh... The, the main compound here, the obelisk. Nothing doing. So far. rendered part of a building, especially we're all clustered together. Yeah, you don't really have a right. distinct shape. They'll think it's a rally point. <laughs> yeah, exactly. They'll think all of us together is a one big rally point. So now, here's the thing. How did they get up here? This is high DC actual. We have not heard any of nearby. I don't like that. Oh, okay, God. Oh, God. That, oh, God. that was, was super the was was what was They're ranging that? us. They're ranging. Okay. Oh, yeah, that's a oh, Blackbeard no. no, 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 That's at what us, dude. They don't know. They don't know. Hold. That oh, they know. They know. They're either south of us in the river. Hold on. Hold. That lat came okay. from the west. Wait. They know? They know? It wasn't a lat. That's a rocket. That's a rocket already. They have a rocket clicker. They 100% know we're here. Yeah, what the fuck? One rocket has taken out the entire stranded squad. Compound is compromised. I need everybody expediting to assist. So I need you laying down the fire. One rocket. I need to send one. Has taken because someone flipped it. The entire stranded squad. I'm asking, can we flip them live? I literally told you what to fucking do. Just have somebody unflip it and get it back on the road. We're just gonna sit, we're gonna sit here. We're gonna sit here for another second. We're gonna look at the map. Actually, we're not gonna do that because Dwarf's guys are about ready. Is this Dwarf's guys? Yeah, Dwarf's got a fire team and they're about ready to take contact. And Doobie Scoo, uh, looks like he may have killed one. 
Doobie Scoot's in the compound, stuck here. Or actually, no, they, he went back outside? He jumped the wall? No, there's no way. Uh, looks like, I think one of the, I think one of Dwarf's guys is dead here. Where is the rest of Doobie's fire team? Why is he by, oh my gosh. Let's go. Okay. So, contact is here. Hawk is now shooting. And Dorf has his guys all around now. Um, oh, a grenade. For my S. Has the distance and hits uh, Freestalker and Verk. Freestalker got a large bit of damage there. He's going to have to bandage quick. Great throw. Oh my god. I don't care if I clip the mic. I wonder how Ines knew. Blackbeard must have seen them. Abu Hujar goes down to support fire from Dorf's other fire team. The rocket techie is now sporadically firing. Uh, looks like Doobie's got his squad back to uh, his fire team back together, and they're starting to uh, make some effort to push in here. Oh my! I saw a f there's a four kill, a grenade. I missed who exactly threw it, but four people on INS just die in one grenade. That was amazing. Uh, looks like Shmi is getting shot up from somewhere. He's getting shot up by Peef. Peef has the eyes on, I think. Oh my gosh. And the suppression is real. They have a little bit of a dip right here, but it's coming down to... Can you aim gun properly? Right now, I just can't. And there's no other way around. They need to get out of here, but they just need to stay still. Um, Phoenix has a Phoenix is caught up to his advanced fire team here. Looks like they took another casualty. Rockets are now landing pretty far off now. Oh, Shadow Wrath. I think he tried to peek inside the compound. Looks like uh, Phoenix and maybe Freestalker may have been responsible for that. Phoenix has a pretty good position here on this wall. It's going to stop the rest of Dwarf's guys from trying to support if they come up through that crack. But Dwarf's guys have moved on. Rockets close to Phoenix. The spread almost kills Command. In the middle of your screen, Razor. Surviving because of the wall. You can see Razor in the middle of your screen here. And all those rockets that just landed right around him. Pretty close. Rocket Techie is real. Uh, oh, and Blackbeard just got pinged by... Looks like uh, the MRAPs have uh, arrived. Blackbeard's made up on the roof here, and he's trying to get some more information for his guys. Blackbeard almost gets hit again. Can't take another hit. <clears throat> he finds the minaret for hard cover. Some of those rockets are landing a little short. The uh, the rocket techie might be trying to engage those guys, and he's just... I wonder if he's not getting the elevation that he needs. But uh, U.S. know that there's a problem here. Squad 2 is still trying to divert north. Um... Faithful's guys are still maintaining security around the MRAPs. The entirety of the uh, Inus platoon has not been made real on the point yet. Right now we're looking at 8 kills US, 15 for INS. Been live for about 20 minutes. Well, actually a little bit less than 20 minutes, but still. Oh no, Revy! One of the rockets landed way short and took out 0.8 bacon. Be careful. Three 
Appa about to bleed out from might be the third casually from that rocket. The rockets need to go up higher. They need another 100 meters of elevation. And wraps are basically unopposed right now. But anyone actually the first step wrap is probably the juicier target it doesn't have the big wall reload Dwarf's fire team have made it across the river. It looks like they are trying to take this compound. Dwarf's trying to provide support on the ground. Phoenix disguise have control over most of the compound. Matter of fact, they're keeping Phoenix inside this wall, inside this second story room here. They've locked the exit off from him. Grenades being thrown up and over. Freestalker may stay al stays alive. Oh, he's blocking the door. Freestalker versus Dwarf. Dwarf's gonna pie the corner. He sees the gun barrel. He takes an early shot at Dwarf, and Dwarf runs away. Captain Verk taking some shots at uh, Salty Toast and company over here. Rom's gonna fire back. Uh, something had to. They, Blackbeard, like you know when I was, I was over here, and Blackbeard went up on the roof. He had to have seen him from there. I told you guys this corner right here may have been possible. Even closer might have been even more possible. They must- he must have seen something from that compound. But... Uh, just the fact that all of them died... from one rocket. Phoenix is down. Such an unfortunate play. The gamble... didn't pay off. Inus still have an uphill battle though. They have to take out these MRAPs. Well, they at least have to bait the MRAPs in. Phoenix, uh, looks like he died inside the compound here. Garrett is still stuck in this compound. He's watching the door to make sure no other US guys come towards his position. Freestalker is also trapped. Verk is nearby, but Verk can't provide any support, and very slowly, Dwarf Skies have uh, crossed to the west. And with the support of Boogie's guys, looks like he's gonna... Actually, Dwarf looks like he's dead. I don't see him on the map anymore. Two squads on the stranded squad's position, on the stranded squad's bodies. We've got Nashville over here, leading squad two now. At, n near the obelisk, and he's in a really good position to help support and catch the INS from behind. MRAPs are actually firing. Are they? I, what is the MRAP firing at? MRAPs are moving in. Infantry with, uh, Aethel's got his infantry close in support on these MRAPs. This could be the opening that INS need to, uh, knock out one of these guys. INS need to kill some MRAPs here if they're gonna seal the deal. Once they do that, I think they got, I think they have round one in the bag. Aethel playing a very smart, keeping a uh, buddy team plus off the road with a little bit of elevation. And he's keeping his vehicles separated. He's got one at the next intersection and one at the previous position. That's extremely important. 
There's a lot of INS infantry that are edging closer to this front MRAP. Screw being elite. Now actually making a taking a fight with uh Senpai. Maybe FXF Tails. I think it's just Senpai. Oh no, they're both there. FXS Tails is the medic. He was very, very cool. Oh yeah, Senpai was having a fight with Scrooby here. Senpai's looking for him. Mm. Scrooby right in the middle of your screen. Just look in this direction, but I don't think they can see each other through the foliage. Oh! Scrooby sees Tails, and Tails takes the bullet. Yeah, eyes on. He's uh, laying uh, down in the field. If you have a grenade, you can toss him in there. One of the bullets hits Scrooby. INS have re- Oh no, it looks like Nashville went down. That other squad needs the coordination. They don't have it anymore. Who's the new squad lead? It's great. It U.S. are still trying to maneuver out here. INS are really on the right position. So it all comes down... Excuse me, it all comes down to how U.S. are going to make a move on this position. Question in chat, will they be around with uh, CAF in the future, uh, Canadian Armed Forces? That depends on the assets being available for modders. At this point, they aren't, uh, to my knowledge. So, we would love to add uh, Canadian Armed Forces in the future, but uh ain't happening right now. Once that once that happens, though, for sure, you'll you'll probably see something in the in the month after they get loosed on the the uh, the mods, uh, the mod access for squad. Woo! Brandon is giving coordination from the rear. No one else here. He needs to get the rest of his guys moving closer. Copy. What about the to, uh, to our Looks like U.S. command has gone down. May have gone down a while ago. But, uh... Athel's trying to uh, coordinate with Brandon as best he can. And it looks like Freestalker's now running for... Oops. Uh... Yeah, looks like everybody else got freaking wiped. Freaking wiped indeed. Alright, let me get on the right side of it. What oh, Snowman wants to take some shots from here. You see someone through the window. It's Chris yeah, the Ninja Pirate, and he goes pro. Chris, uh... Uh, he wants to take a shot at this, uh, he wants to take a shot back. He's looking for the contact. He sees it, but, uh, problems as the MRAPs have, uh, rolled up. One MRAP off the road. He's gonna park it right here. I wonder how long it's gonna last. Lyle Bean has to be shooting anything that pops up. This is the, uh, the, the highest stakes version of whack and you can play for squad. You gotta be suppressing everything, you have to be shooting everything because the way the vehicle is... The way the vehicle is turned, it's the optimal uh, angle for INS to try to shoot the gunner out of the top of the turret. US are forcing their way closer here on the north side of this compound.
Both MRAPs are actually still up. This is kind of insane. I would have expected these MRAPs to be shot by RPGs by now. Zimzam, the rules? Uh, you have one life. Once you hit the give up screen, you're done. You may not be revived. Rocket, short! It hits the wall! Can't talk after death. You have to, uh... You have one life. You can't get revives in one life operations. About 90%, 90 to 5, 99% of the time. Sergeant Jackson, Senpai, and FXF Tails are gonna make a breach here. Seneca dies. Senpai, through the door! What a shot. Grenade goes off close and Sergeant Jackson eats it. And it looks like Splodge dies too. That's the driver of the MRAP. Dies to a grenade. 16 kills, US 23 INS. US are keeping it competitive here. The other squad is moving, but is it gonna be too little too late? US need the numbers on this compound. They need the grenades too. They need to rearm for grenades off these MRAPs and start throwing. They want to use this uh, opening here. Chris the Ninja Pyre takes out Tails. And Ines grenade getting thrown. Looks like it, uh, anticipating infantry to their northwest. Not quite there. Senpai and Snowman trying to figure out how to skin this pig. Senpai goes down. Looks like, uh, that could have been Boogie shot him through the uh, exact same door he shot the other guy from. <clears throat> Vehicle exploding. Madness. Oh, and the MRAP kills Boogie. Far side still on this MRAP, unopposed. Lima Bean's talking to his driver to get Arnis uh, to move this thing in the right okay. position. What do you think Something tells me Aethel's dead too. Yeah, Aethel's dead. Uh, Renit is the only one with the command beach. comms, That's and he's running option. his guys up we the north side. These guys are all in coordination with the, the, each other still, because they're all in the same squad, but, uh... No one has command comms. Because I don't see Aethel. Yeah, revives are not allowed in one life operations. Another RPG shot misses the MRAP. I think it's just the MRAP. Why don't I actually play? I play sometimes. I play sometimes. You guys, I have fun. I have fun doing this. And here comes our, our Granite's guys. Looks like he's got eight. Uh, actually, seven. Including himself. And they're gonna start poking their way towards the compound. I don't know if INS have eyes. Hey, we have contacts in the compound, Granite. Airborne and Granite are running straight at this thing. Shmi leading the way. Bacon is... Nope, Bacon's dead. Yeah. Who's here at the door? Captain Dillon yeah. is watching it. Captain Dillon's watching it from here. Take some Follow shots. Window. window in front of me. Watch the and side. Wolfgang. Multiple people are watching He's this the doorway. Window. And Brunt's just walking around the corner. He's dead. I'll get him. I've got a friend. And Shmi dies. 
Medic's down. Okay. You got it, get him. It's kind of hard to get all everything into the to fit in the camera here, but uh. Correct. Yeah, someone come with me. I'm with. You see, U.S. forces are gonna try to go around this. Uh, oh, other guys are too. Oh, yeah. look at this. Peef is just holding this inside corner here. He's gonna kill whoever comes through. If he stops moving around, airborne like he's dead. perforates him. Someone will push up in front of me. While I and now Wolf King has to I'm switch to here. watching this I through a the uh, the there, through a bush. On the left side. And looks like uh, he goes down. Uh, Someone watching. A, oh, it's an oddball. Not in the building. Behind. Airborne. Behind. Behind Ludwig dies? Where did Ludwig die from? From behind, question mark? No, I think Ludwig right, just had a bad up. angle. Pickle I think Hoppa got him. Shoutouts to Hoppa. It's been a bit since I've seen him. And Hoppa dies. Nice, he's in. Big whoop. He didn't die. Getting slowly whittled down on the compound. 23 US to 28 it. INS. US are pushing it back. Thanks for the bump in the bitrate. Uh. Got one more. Nice. Uh, I've been pushing six megabits since the beginning of the stream, so. Oddball versus airborne. These guys. Oddball's been hit twice. Airborne finally hit. Oddball has to bandage here if he wants to stay alive. Hey, turn around, turn around, turn around. Captain Dillon. He's, he's towards our southeast. Oh, is Oddball going to throw a grenade here? Because that would turban. be epic. Oddball stabilizes. Lagar wants to try to get a piece of this. I might have killed him, but he's might be low. I'm holding that grenade sure. from, uh -oh. from over here, too. Oddball waiting for Legar to take a peek at him. Legar spams the corner. Did you kill him? Oddball's waiting for him to come up and around. Let's see if we hey, can try to get an angle here. from his perspective. Yep. Yep, so this is what Oddball's uh, basically okay. saying right now. There's that little rise at the edge of the hill next to the foundation of the building. It looks like Oddball is elected to crawl back. Lagar dies here, as along with Dylan. Arnis and Lima Bean have driven the MRAP to the wall. Looks like they've abandoned it. INS are surrounding these guys, and they even have another fire team. Coming around the north side, it's curtains for US in round one. Minty, the only one left. South side of the compound, Lima Bean and Arnis are gonna do what they can here. Uh, Oddball is just running around like a madman. He's now on the north side of the compound, we looking up the road. Left? Like, I, don't, I just don't know. I actually don't know how many people are left. Ask them, maybe. Yo, Minty, is it only you? I, I believe so. I'm the only one. Okay. Left that. I don't know if there's anyone behind. Do you know maybe we push like... together? Oh, no one knows what happened to Squad One. No one knows how it happened friendly, to the stranded friendly, squad. Friendly. Minty's coming back around. Watch this door when pushing south, because I think there's another one in there still. Oddball, or Lima Bean doing what he can to, uh... Oh, and oh, they're taking shots at him. Scrooby taking some shots yeah, at him. From the east, okay. Yeah, I ducked, I ducked. They're looking to his uh, northeast yet? Okay. Here's what I'm Cut. doing. See you later. Live being in the compound now. Will Arnis and Minty follow suit? I'm pushing okay. inside. Oh, no, they're gonna go mm -hmm. into the side here. Arnis, you. Below, you blow the screen here. Dr. Forbes is... Oh, look in another direction. Um... Oh, some in south? Whoa, Arnis? Wait, Lava Bean's still alive? Do you want me to nade? Got another? No, 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 I have a nade. I need to reload. US have pushed into hey, the... Minty. 
Uh, you check backside so they don't push from back. Uh, looks like uh, Revy holding a sick angle inside the compound. Arnis is going to throw a grenade inside the next door. Not going to be effective enough. And here comes... And he gets shot in the back. Oddball comes up and through. I think that's going to do it. Is uh, Minty still alive? I don't think so. And that's going to be round one. A brutal defeat for U.S. forces in Operation Spartan Trail. But that is just the beginning. Round two coming up very soon. We'll see if... Uh, I, I guess we'll see if uh, the Stranded Squad don't all get blown up by an RPG right off the bat. Um... The, the bare minimum but uh you know it happens it happens sometimes sometimes the plan is so good it is doomed to fail it happens um who actually made that kill blackbeard uh which rpg made it seven so it may have been oddball May have been Oddball that got the kill. I don't know why I didn't count to nine. Because the whole squad was there. Anyway, that's all good. We're going to take a break. And uh, when we come back, we'll be uh, doing uh, round number two. Uh, earlier in the last round. We were live with round two. The uh, compound here. Pretty similar in uh, pretty similar in, uh, construction to the other one. Mm -hmm. So lots of uh, people holding the all of the doors inside the compound, all the Wait, angles internally. Wait, is that there in that freaking tower thing? Thing? No, you're not. Okay. This is a more. I would say it's a tri uh Well, it's it's one of the ways you would try to maximize the survivability. Uh, actually, let's look at uh, INS. Three squads in the west instead of all four. We're seeing Aethel move his guys straight north. He's got a fire team north across the river. Merrick looks like he's making a beeline to... Uh, he's going to leapfrog here, check these buildings, and then go up to Obelisk. And then we've got Jack 800 leading squad four now. Uh, Bravo 10-9 moving probably along the southern border to check these compounds. Meanwhile, U.S., two squads sprinting for the position. We need to fly over here to the east. I need to turn my flight speed on to a little bit faster than 4,000 units uh, because I believe the convoy is headed straight for Alpha Guido's uh, Bad Lads, Yeah, yeah, you can see there's four, there's three light units here. And they're moving straight for this bridge. Uh, there's some vehicles. Uh, there are some vehicles doing vehicle things. I must investigate this. Do they know they can reset vehicles now? Actually, I don't think they're allowed to. I think that's part of the thing. We got it, we got it. Yeah, don't go full speed over narrow bridges. That will happen to you, and it will be embarrassing. Sadly, this will give uh, Alpha's guys all the position they need. I guarantee you Sasa is licking his lips very shortly as I'm pretty sure these guys are headed straight down this road. Um, 
Not sure how close. That's the INS Rocketeki. It's not aiming correctly. I do hear shots over here. We will uh, investigate shortly. But uh, this MRAP's about ready to be hit by an RPG. A miss! A second miss! One, one MRAP goes through. Are they going to run the second one through the same way? Yes, they are. No, they're going to hold it. That's not good. They need to keep moving. These guys are ready now, but do they have any more AT? Scottish chap has AT, but he doesn't have a shot on it from here. That wall's in his way. Oh, no. Uh, we're getting some move outs here. INS are displacing West. They're going to try to fall back to another position, maybe get elevation to hit this, uh, the rest of this convoy. And the U.S. are going to actually find another route. That's unfortunate. We're going to go over and zoom into the West now. The MRAP that made it is on its way. And there is some shots being fired. Looks like some uh, casualties have been incurred on INS's part. Two kills for US right now to zero for INS. US actually pushed out pretty far north here. Rocket techie. That was a real close rocket shot. The MRAP is actually in support now of U.S. forces. So U.S. have surrounded. They've taken the north and south flanks away from INS, so they can't maneuver on the compound. Command is actually now in here. So command will be able to put down a radio, but some rockets are uh, becoming real. The rocket technical needs to get needs to step up that aggression here. Looks like an MRAP is now. MRAPs also try to get in the fight from long distance here. There's still Alpha Squad behind. The rocket technical is just not on target. It needs to it needs to go right like two degrees. Yeah, I was covering the south wall. Ooh, Farsight gets binked by Seneca there. I think. Watch for hand grenades. Watch for hand grenades. I'll pop it up. U.S. is being really aggressive. They've set a fire team flank out on this northern wall. They don't know it yet, but they're in a really good position to just move down and storm that compound. Grenade actually touches Fizco and Elite. Light damage to both of them. They're really lucky. That grenade was really well thrown. More casualties for INS in the south. I know we were playing Star Trek. Rockets now landed. Pretty close to Oddball's fire team here. Go, Oddball go, go, go. knows out, get they're out, get close. Out, get out, get out. And there's really no way they can hold this area. There's only one way out that's relatively open to them. Rockets overshooting. Yep, and that northern fire team started pushing south and Spludge was out of position. He left the compound, he got shot. So it's now it's just Farsight and Arnis holding the north compound here. If U.S. continue to close in this northern flank, they could really put INS in a bad spot. Although INS, one river crossing away from reaching their objective area and clearing it. But it's just a squad attacking versus a squad defending. It's not enough people. Hotball adding some support by fire on distance here. Looks like Jacko 800 squad got noticed. 
Not all of those rounds seem to be on target. Maybe it's all about suppression at this point. The rockets have stepped up their uh, frequency in their attack, but they're just not on target. Looks like he overcorrected right. More rockets would have killed Oddball if he stood where he, if he stayed where he was a minute ago. Here comes INS from behind. Alaji and the second MRAP have made it to the southern side. What's the story for this op? U.S. are rescuing a squad. They're going to reinforce the squad's position here instead of exfilling the squad. So the U.S. are going to build up this point with... Uh, they can build an HMG and all the fortifications they desire. They have to hold out against an, against an INS attack. And, yeah, Oddball has started shooting... Looks like the, Chris the Ninja Pirate and Baker Batman from behind. Ooh, Exoskeleton dies to the MRAP. This is supposed to be the Vehicle Hunter Killer Squad, and the vehicle they're hunting is stationary. In before a rocket hits stationary vehicle. Appa is looking for anyone to stand up Let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. We can't, like... Oh, round one? We're not talking about round one. Someone post a link to the clip. That's all you need to know. Well, it's not all you need to know. US made a really good effort, but it just, they didn't have the numbers to attack a static comp, the, the defending compound. <clears throat> oh, Fisco making it across. Loses a man behind him, but Fisco makes it up into the death lane. Need help, please. Bisco is stuck out here by himself. Reloading. Time for Seneca to get into war. The Northern Fire Team looks like Scrooby dies. They uh, they were a little bit too slow in pushing into the compound here, so April has reinforced it with a uh, fire with a with an understrength fire team. Looks like grenades bounce off the wall. Grenades. Grenades. Kills himself. Nice throw. U.S. are doing really good, and Alpha's actually pulled off, and they're headed north. Hmm, so they want to use this draw to get in position. Oh, and meanwhile, here comes the MRAP. More casualties in the south. Looks like Tinkerbell goes down. Highness may have broken, their pos broken out of their position a little bit, and if they're going to cause some U.S. some problems. There's about a squad... There's a fire team that's actually out of position and they're being run around on. I don't think they have any idea. The Modern Death and Peef are still looking west. There's a fire team that's just pushed right past them in the field. And they're looking to leave the field on the east side. There's a fire team stuck up here for US. It's bad news. INS are actually too spread out right now. They need to they need to get back together. Doesn't look like it's happening. Meanwhile, Ethel dies. Seneca to leap pop him through the window. It's just wow, Sergeant Jackson it. inside the courtyard okay, here, and Grom's gonna take this corner. And Jackson has the faster shot. But Jackson gets Riddled by Fisco's AR. That's as Jackson tries to run to uh, cover. Actually, probably tried to run inside the building. We got, we got a door. All clear. All clear. Left side. It's a great positional advantage for US now. That they're going to lose here in the next 5 or 10 minutes. Rockets. That land really close to Hedda? 
More rockets. Oh, a TK. Ludwig von Beefoven. Black T also gets a piece right here. Bobby, what's going on, dude? Appreciate you guys watching over on YouTube and Twitch. It's been an exciting day. More rockets. These are really much... These are these are much better uh, bursts of fire. The spread is just too wide on the rocket pods. You gotta be firing these things. You gotta be laying down some... Uh, some real uh, madness if you're going to use the rocket pods. You can't just fire two or three rockets and expect it to be effective. Oddball and John fighting their way out, trying to reach friendly forces. Oh, there we go. John and Oddball take out two more. Great way to get out. Uh, is Tubisky going to be able to shoot him in the back? No, I don't think so. <clears throat> I think those are the ones made out. I don't think Modern and uh, the other guy made it. Nope, Modern and Peef are still up. Way over there on the south wall. Alpha Guido's guys moving slowly closer. Like a younger wolf blitzer for war? Yo. Uh. Yeah, that's an MRAP dead. Finally, the vehicle squad coming in. Was it abandoned? I don't think, there's no way it could have been abandoned. I think it was just sitting at the intersection and not uh, paying attention. Wasn't aware. Uh, regardless, Serranos, I need to get over this cold first. Think of my voice back. Position. Alpha Guido and his guys three, making a three, beeline, zero. ignoring the Western compound. Copy. Trying to get his guys in a position to move straight on the compound here. Remain divided INS forces not doing too well. Seven kills INS, 21 for US. Uh, last pocket of INS. Uh, actually, there's two little pockets of INS here to the south. Raise your commanding. There's a fire team plus on, his bo on him right now. Looks like they're going to sweep around here to the east. And we've still got Jack 800 leading Old Geezer and Doobie Scoo, trying to figure out the best way to... Uh, they actually might be chasing Oddball and John. I don't know if they know about Modern Earth and Peef. Modern Earth and Peef taking a uh, different approach. They got split up. They're trying to make sure they don't get shot as they oh, run back. Have to fucking do... So Modern we Earth know knows. we got contacts in the field in front of us. Modern nose. Ooh. Don't get shot was obliterated. No, wait. No, I'm kidding. He's just watching them. Whew. Sometimes, guys, people don't give up before they go into spectator cam, and I get confused. Ines just trying to maneuver here. Alpha's up here by himself. Where's the rest of his guys? Why haven't they, why haven't they made the trip? Alpha hearing AR fire out of his west, close. And being a little bit careless here, we'll probably get Alpha Guido, anyone being careless in that compound rather, is going to get Alpha Guido a kill. What? Wait. No. Pony Tink and Frederick did not just throw a frag there.
Frederick's engaging. Sauce is dead. Frederick is levitating. And looks like everyone else gets out of the line of fire. Forces them to move closer. If you don't get shot, was dead, was there, and he just died. Razor leading an exodus straight up. Everyone is back together. He's got a squad size force. Ooh, and Bacon Batman leading. Oh, Bacon Batman sees Razor. That's one. Bacon Batman kills INS command. And INS are now stuck in a field. Grenades going off. Not close enough to Minty or Lagar. Shmi is still hit, but bandages. Minty gets lasered by Captain Dillon to his north. Chris, the ancient pirate, He's chases down. after He's Black Tea. Copy that. All right, let's. Uh, Ines in the south, in the uh, south here, just down to yeah. four. Jack eight hundred old geezer Lagar and Shmi. Uh, Twenty-seven kills for U.S. right now. Ten for U.S. Captain Dylan gets winged, and he's looking like he's looking for a medic. He might bleed out. Watch that right, that corner though, nope. they can see it. I would say he's looking for a medic, but... Hit. No, he's not. Guido is dead over here, so it's I'm just... Sure. Another squad's still up. Koig, Young Bands, and uh, Scrather Scottish Chap. Looking to see what they could be doing up here. Not very, not gonna be very effective. Old Geezer gets hit. And Shmi gets hit again. Second bandage for Shmi. Can't poke your head up. You gotta move along. Can't stay here. They need to move out. And US are now sweeping the field. Geezer's hit again. He's got a second bandage used. Lagar trying to provide some cover fire. U.S. are slowly sweeping the field west to east. All INS can do is stay in front of the field. What is he shooting at? There's no one over there. Modern Death and Peef. Straight along the wall. They're like trying to close in on that uh, fire. Old Geezer and Shmi, smart to uh, move back a little bit. Oh, looks like Shmi is actually a medic. Which is smart, which means Shmi has more than two damages. He's moving. He's moving. Minor death hears him. Lagar right gets Chris the Ninja Pirate. He kills Peef. Peef was looking through the field. Logar goes down. Me and old uh, geezer. Next to a field, fuck. Oh, that's fucking TK. TK on modern. Modern gets Shmi, but takes a bullet. He's dead. He's dead. He's probably dead. Keep moving. I see him. He's dead. The kind of. If old geezer shoots. If old geezer shoots, he's uh, gonna give his position away. He needs to wait a second. Looks like US don't think he's alive anymore. Meanwhile, rather this guy's chapping folks are making a break for it. We're gonna take a look at this. Boy, he's making a mad dash for the next wall. Rather this guy's chapping young bands are uh, looking for a way to do the same. Boy, he looks like he might be starting to take a peek here. I don't know if uh, U.S. are going to be able to see that. Old Geezer kills Alpha, modern death. That's 
past him. And sees him out the corner of his eye, turns around, goes straight for him. Good job. Up is down. B way, where you are? Uh, the last three uh, INS on the map. 13 kills INS to 31 for US. I think Quake is taking some shots here with Silas. I say last three, but there's actually four left. Silas is still up. Wait, is Airborne up? No, Airborne's dead, right? No, Airborne's dead. Jeez. Yikes. Uh, Silas is looking for people to shoot. Taking his time. Doing the thing. And he causes, looks like that might have been your nightmare. Your nightmare goes prone, repositions. Mm -hmm. back against the wall. Just doing 360s on the spot. I'm watching everything. <laughs> we do that in the German military. Maybe it too. wasn't your nightmare. Quake and Silas make a run up close. Just have everyone just spin around. around circle to watch spin around with an MG3. Quake lets out a few rounds. And that's Hawk dead. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, and now. Okay, oh, and Silas here gets destroyed. Or Koi gets That's destroyed from behind. Aww. I guess it's I Mantis. Think, uh, no, Mantis is dead. Silas is you, stuck behind a wall. Smoke's going out. Smoke in the water. Yeah, that means they're running. Oh, I hear running outside the wall. And Silas just trying to do anything he can to stay alive here. Uh, soon will be. What's that? Silas makes a dash. Who else is left? I think it's just it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I think it's just Silas. I don't think anyone else is up. Oh, well, the rather scouts chap and young bands are still up. It looks like. Kind of amazing, they actually made it all the way here by himself. Meanwhile, Silas might be shot. Yep. Multiple people t put bullets into Silas. You didn't see <laughs> and Young Bands and Rather Scout is chat. Wait. Rocket was too close to arm. One by me. Rather Scout is chap uh, threw, a, uh, threw a frag around close, didn't arm. Everyone's now falling back to the compound for U.S. to try to provide yeah, close security. Main door. I think and rather Scott's chap and young bands are about ready to find themselves shot in the side. Once Pudi Ting and Seneca come up over this ridge, Seneca might already see. I think Seneca and Pudi Ting are going to have the best shots on these guys here because they're just standing here. Oh, uh, the wall's in the way. May not be the case, but Seneca. Seneca sees Scottish chap, kills him, scans, young bands, behind the wall. Contact close up. Young bands runs into the compound and is dead. And I think that's gonna do it for us. That is GG called 35 kills US, 14 INS. What a way to end round two. Spartan Trail in the books.